Okay, I need to tell you about the entire process that goes into these shirts because I really love them. They are the most beautiful shirt we've ever made yet. These are made out of a light cotton wall. It's basically like a really, really light semi-sheer cotton and literally perfect for the summer. And I work with a factory that I have known for like six years here in the garment district. And what they do for us is they actually construct these shirts with French seaming. Basically what that means is they work over each seam like three times. They sew it once, they trim the seam, and then they flip it on itself and sew it again. Gives it this really beautiful clean finish on the inside and out. While these are being constructed in the garment district, we are a couple blocks over to Ceramic Studio hand making all of our Narakomi A buttons. And we cookie cutter out each button one by one. Once we do that, we poke five holes into each button. You can probably tell that that layout doesn't look like your regular shirt button. And that's because we want these to look like an A when they're threaded for our label, Andrew New York. And uh, you can't make the same button twice just because of how Narakomi works. So each shirt has five buttons that have never been made before and will never be made again. As our factory is finishing up these shirts and the buttons have been glazed and are put in the kiln, uh, we head over to Saffron, Brooklyn for floral inspiration. For Tom's shirt number 15, we asked Alice in Wonderland to come along and arrange a bouquet just for us. Once Allison had finished the bouquet, it was time to take it back to our studio, photograph it for reference, put together a layout, and get to painting. My first point of inspiration was old master sketches. I just love these visual studies and how you can tell that nothing is really a finished work as much as it is an observation of what they're looking at. They're learning, they're getting to know their subject, and that's kind of how I wanted to treat the flowers as I painted them. And then aesthetically, uh, one of my favorite exhibits at the MoMA was the Cezanne exhibit on his watercolor sketches. They have such a dreamlike quality to them and are very joyful. And so I wanted to take those two ideas and, and combine them into creating these shirts. From there, we paint each one individually. They all have a similar layout and a similar feel, but each shirt has its own individual brush strokes, its individual qualities that make it its own garment. Um, but yeah, that's kind of all there is to it. If you like this, please follow us here. Check out our website and uh, come see us at a pop-up here in the city for the rest of the summer. And I think that that is, oh, no. I know what you're thinking, can these be washed? Yes, yes they can be washed, don't worry.